Good morning, Newcastle, and welcome to NCTV 45's News Watch on this fine Sunday, May 28th, 2023. we got a couple great stories coming up for you, but first, we want you to hear from our great sponsors. You think there's nothing to do in Newcastle and Lawrence County? Then think again! Always stay connected to NCTV 45 to receive the information on events going on in and around the area on a daily basis. Programs to view are News Watch, The Morning Show, and Community Happenings. NCTV 45 takes pride in bringing you the event and organization info that you want. NCTV 45 is the number one media source locally. NCTV 45, anytime on your time. Special thanks to Butts, Flowers, Gifts, and more in downtown Newcastle for their support and funding of this program. Butts Flowers, downtown Newcastle. If you're hungry, don't be out in the desert. Head on down to the old oasis for breakfast. If you're hungry, don't be out in the desert. Head on down to the old oasis for daily specials. Yes, appetizers, sandwiches, beverages. It's the Oasis Bar, 303 South. Jefferson Street, call 724-652-6104. Peppers, mouth-watering fruit, fine dressings, apples, meats. This place looks so familiar. Getting your lunch meat, cut to order. That's the Joseph's difference. They make every opportunity to please their customers. Joseph's. They're not the big box store giving you it the way the store wants it. It's the way you want it. Stop by Joseph's and take a look. Yes, it's Joseph's. NCTV 45. Strong enough to Lawrence County. We're going to start you off like we always do with the birthdays. Angelo Greco, Jackie Hayborger, Jessica Kibelis, Lauren Nicole Dato Kirkwood, Regina Johnson, Leanne Slagle-Holmes, and Bobby Lynn Gurman. Happy birthday to all you guys out there. Make sure you get that second piece of birthday cake. As for your news stories, well, let's take a different path real quick here. Let's start with your national holidays. The Indy 500, National Brisket Day, National Hamburger Day, Abolition Day, Amnesty International Day, Founding of the Dominic Democratic Republic of the Azerbaijan, International Day of Action on Women's Health Day, Julia Pierpoint Day, National Day of Ethiopia, National Flag Day in the Philippines, National Jake Day, Pentecost Sunday, Slugs Return from Capistrano Day, <laughs> Whit Sunday, Whooping Crane Day, World Hunger Day, and World Passion Fruit Martini Day. A lot of great food holidays today. We're going to head over to the Cedar Sports Corner Report and take a look at around the sports world for your Sunday. We'll be right back. The Cedar's Restaurant in Newcastle wants you to indulge in the food from their pleasing menu. The Cedar's features Mediterranean, pub food, Middle Eastern cuisine, and so much more. They're open every day, 11 a.m. to 10 p.m. Call the Cedars on the east side at 827 Addis Street, Newcastle, 724-658-9543. That's 
Hello and welcome to Lindy's Lunch. Yes, whether it's their great breakfast or just like it says lunch, it's great anytime. Try their breakfast and you'll be satisfied. A pierogi cheeseburger, an Italian Joe, and smothered hoagies. All oh, and don't forget the French fries with chili. Yes, it's Lindy's lunch for the best. Stop by. Give us a call. Sunday. MLB, or excuse me, the NHL and NBA are both off as all of the playoff series have off days. So, we'll head over to the MLB then. At 11.35, the Tampa Bay Rays will play host to the LA Dodgers in a pitching matchup that will feature Gavin Stone against Taj Bradley. Another great pitching matchup here in this game is Hugh Darvish will take the bump against Garrett Cole at 1.35 as the Yankees will play host to the Padres. Also at 1.35, the Baltimore Orioles will play host to the Texas Rangers. Two 140 games, the White Sox travel to Detroit to take on the Tigers. And Hunter Gaddis takes the bump for the Cleveland Guardians as they will play host to the St. Louis Cardinals. Big 2-10 slate for you. We have three games here. San Francisco goes to Milwaukee. Minnesota plays host to Toronto. And Kansas City hosts Washington. Ten minutes later, Cincinnati travels to Can to Chicago to take on the Cubs in an NL Central matchup. At 3:10, the Colorado Rockies will play host to the New York Mets. 4:07, two games as Houston travels to Oakland to take on the soon-to-be Vegas A's, and the LA Angels will play host to the Miami Marlins. At 4:10, the Arizona Diamondbacks will play host to the Boston Red Sox, and the Buccos are also on at 4:10 as they will travel to Seattle. That game can be found on ESPN+. Plus. And the Buccos will go against Marco Gonzalez. Spencer Strider been red hot for the Atlanta Braves, as they will host the Philadelphia Phillies, who have undecided on a starter right now, on Sunday Night Baseball at 7 o'clock on ESPN2. So, just Major League Baseball today. As for your local sports, the NHS National, or NFHS, excuse me, National Federation of High Schools has announced a new rule. Instead of the one and one, one free throw you get if you make the first, you get the next shot. That has been eliminated. The double, the bonus will just be five fouls each quarter, and will eliminate the one and one. Every player will shoot two free throws after they get into the bonus. So that's all we got for today. Make sure you head over to the Cedars, catch out all these great games, enjoy the great food. We're gonna take a quick timeout. We'll be Allie's Upper Crust at 1700 Highland Avenue has a full menu. Pizza, roll-ups, salad, soup, sandwiches, strombolis, dinners. They are just great for dine-in or take-out. Don't forget to give them a call at 724-652-7553. It's Alley's Upper Crust. This program furnished by Sporting Goods, 23 East Washington Street, Newcastle. Call 724-658-2535. Los Amigos! Ladies and gentlemen, if you need a good bite to eat, make sure to check out Los Amigos. They got you covered with things such as tacos, burritos, gente, and don't forget the great chips and salsa they put out for you when you get there. Make sure to check out Los Amigos on West State Street, Newcastle, PA, 16101. It's Los Amigos. Los Amigos! Los Amigos! Shapiro signs executive order directing Department of Aging to develop master plan for older adults. On Thursday, Governor Shapiro signed an executive order in Scranton authorizing the Pennsylvania Department of Aging to develop a 10-year state-led and stakeholder-driven strategic plan designed to help transform the infrastructure and coordination of services for older Pennsylvanians. The master plan will also reflect the needs and preferences of this population to live where they choose and access the supports they need to thrive 
and age in place. As part of creating the plan, the department will host several regional kickoff events that will be open to anyone interested in hearing about the plan. The Department of Aging has created a webpage dedicated to the Master Plan for Older Adults at aging.pa.gov slash master plan, which provides information on why a master plan is needed, the core tenants, and how the department will gather input for the plan, resources, and more. Individuals who would like to submit input on the plan can either email agingplan at pa.gov, provide feedback through an online form, or mail the Pennsylvania Department of Aging co-master plan 555 walnut street fifth floor in harrisburg pa 17101 a few things in the plan governor shapiro and the aging department officials announced the ambitious plan which will also address the needs of people living with disabilities at a pair of public events in screen on thursday things such as lower cost for health care independent living to skilled nursing homes healthy food to strong community centers we will listen to Pennsylvania's many seniors and build a plan to address the many challenges that they face, said the governor on Friday. In Hummelstown, PA, PLC Beats celebrate grand opening of fine wine and good spirits in Hummelstown in Dauphin County. The Pennsylvania Liquor Control Board will celebrate the grand opening of a fine wine and good spirits at Meadows Marketplace, 261 Hershey Road in Hummelstown, Dauphin County at 1 p.m. on Tuesday, May 30th. This is at... 261 Hershey Road in Humblestown, PA, and contact Sean M. Kelly with more questions. The Fine Wine and Good Spirits offers consumers a new shopping experience with an expanded floor plan, warm and welcoming environment, and an even greater selection. So, we're going to head over to Lawrence County 45 weather and take a look at how the weather's looking for your Sunday and your upcoming days. Hopefully it's looking pretty good like this weekend already has. We'll be right back. Yes, friends, Chalella and Carney Floral Designs is alive and well in Newcastle. Owner and designer Stephen Doherty and his staff have a special motto. We love what we do, and it shows in every area of the business. Stop by their pleasant Southside store at 1006 South Mill Street. Chalella and Carney has been there for the community with quality and service since 1943. You can go to the website, chalellaandcarney.com, or call 724-652-8412. Since you were going for gas, you might as well fill up your tank too. Delicious food available at Morgan's. And that's just two exciting combos that they have. Morgan's, right across the line. Come dine with us, come dine, come dine today. If you could use some real good food, there's a place not far away. If you could use a drink or two, to go and play come to gallows italian villa today when your pc looks like this don't make it a last key make it pulaski pulaski pc Easy clean car and van wash where your clean wash is our goal. The Crane Room is a restaurant. The Crane Room is a bar. The Crane Room is a banquet facility. The restaurant will please you time after time with their diverse menu. Ask about their daily specials. See the menu at craneroom.com. The bar gives you an abundance of choices with 35 beers on tap and always changing. Their banquet services are always to perfection. The Crane Room located at 3009 Wilmington Road in Ashanic Township. Call 724-656-1553. Well, hello and welcome to Lawrence County 45 weather. 
And after last night, not too, too shabby, bad of low 49 under cloudy skies. How is your Memorial Day weekend looking? And as we get to the second part of the weekend, let's look at local radar. Clear. Now that really enhanced by the no, the national radar where you could see clearing a few wispy clouds in western Pennsylvania and Ohio, but behind it, you've got a clear shot all the way to the Pacific Ocean and beyond. Baja Peninsula having a little bit of rain down there and some precipitation, but the lion's share of the radar showing some cloud cover in West Texas, but nothing to write home about there. So you're going to be in great shape as you look at the Lawrence County Courthouse with yesterday's parade outside. Let's take a look at your forecast. Well, last night, 49 and cloud cover. Lawrence County 45 weather telling you that your Sunday, and here you're going to love this, sunshine and 80 degrees. Just a great day to get out to a pool if it's around and uh, enjoy, start the enjoyment of this weekend. Now, Sunday night, partly cloudy, a low of 54. Now, as you get in to your Monday, Memorial Day, you're going to have a little bit of cloud cover, but for the most part, clear. Sunshine, 83. Going to be a great day to get to the pools and uh, just enjoy. Now, we're not going to dip down that much on Monday night. That's the reason for the cloud cover. We're only going to go down to 57. That's setting you up for Tuesday. Sunshine returns and up to 83 you go. Now, Tuesday night, mostly clear, a low of 57. Wednesday, keep that sunshine coming as we get up to 84. Temperatures start to warm up. Wednesday night, mostly clear, overnight low of 58. And your Thursday, sunshine, 87. Not so shabby as we embark on and knocking on the door of June, this June 1st. So, uh, sunshine 87. Now, Thursday night, mostly clear and 59. Your Friday, sunshine, get this, up to 89 degrees you go. And so, just a fantastic summer-type week as you make it through. Now, what you should do is make sure you get to visit these great sponsors. They'd really like to see you. And also, we're going to take a look at the weather chart. This was Lawrence County 45 weather. Have a great week. for Kimmel's. If you're in need of great baked goods, perhaps donuts of every kind, or maybe a lady lock is your desire. Turnovers, and don't forget, they have cakes of every size, quarter sheet cake, or a round one for that special birthday. And never forget to pick up a loaf of bread it's Kimmel's, home of the delicious, super mouth-watering strudels. Call Kimmel's for the best baked goods. Hi, pizza friends. You can still find delicious Augustine's Pizza at your local supermarket. The folks at Augustine's Pizza hope that their pizza is always your first choice for any and all occasions.
The Hoyt Arts and Education is pleased to announce the winners of the 2023 Eugene L. DiCaprio Undergraduate Art Scholarship Awards. This program was created in honor of Hoyt Center for the Arts trustee, Eugene L. DiCaprio. Mr. DiCaprio has been presenting, performing, and advocating for arts and culture in Lawrence County for more than six decades. While the program is certainly not Mr. DiCaprio's first honor, it is one very close to his heart as it supports continuing education, educational graduating seniors in Lawrence County who will continue to pursue a career in the arts. In the arts. This year, there are Isabella Jones of Newcastle Junior Senior High School and Reagan Quinn of Lincoln Performing Arts. Not only does the program honor Mr. DiCaprio's lifelong commitment to the arts, but offers graduating seniors a $1,000 scholarship to help further their arts-based careers. Jones plans to study game simulation at Miami of Ohio University, while Quinn will pursue a degree in illustration at the University of Savannah College of, Art, of Arts. So, we're going to head to a quick break, and we will be right back to wrap you up. Today's programming is brought to you by NCTV45 and NC Radio 450, Newcastle's community television station. At our law firm, we see you. Come see us at lgkg.com. TV 45, just a friendly reminder, we're available anytime on your time. Yes, a train that runs on your schedule. Well, that's NCTV 45. So, maybe the end of your weekend, but next week we'll have something new for you. So, thank you for tuning in. Have a great rest of your weekend. Looking forward to next week, and we'll see you again real soon.